Hanif. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Hi, my darlings. Hi, loves. Welcome back to another weekly vlog. Me sit down and greet you guys properly. Hi, my darlings. Welcome back to another weekly vlog. Hello to a whole 130,000 of you. We hit 130,000 subscribers. I am so happy. We're reaching our goal of 200,000 subscribers by the end of the year. But hey, loves, and welcome back to another video. Welcome back to another weekly vlog. Um, I am so refreshed. I was home with family and I'm back. So, yeah, today is Monday. I shouldn't be doing anything, but I'm going to have breakfast at home later more. And then we're going to go sit, um, buy some skincare. I need skincare. Like, I need new skincare. You guys know I change my skincare every single time. Winter is coming and I'm going to start using new products because once my skin gets used to, to another product, it's done for. So, um, yeah. I hope you guys are good. hope you guys are well. I've missed you so much. I haven't vlogged like a week. Guys, vlogging gives me... Let me... My sliding door. Sorry. Guys, you don't understand the sense of purpose vlogging gives me. Like, I love it here. I love vlogging so much. It literally is one of the things that makes me feel whole. That's how much vlogging is. But the weather is so nice. It's gloomy. I love gloomy weather. So I'm just going to give you guys a strip check. And then we're going to get going. Because the place that I'm going to is... It's a new place. I've never been there. It's... Um, I think the Fat Zebra. Something like that. Like I said, it's new. I've never been there. Can we give you guys a trip and go? Um, I'm wearing this. I'm wearing these leggings from Sheen. I'm wearing this top from Sheen. I'm wearing my Burberry cap. I'm wearing my Gucci um, Gucci shoes. And I'm gonna carry. The, I'm gonna carry this fur coat slash jacket if you may, because it is cold. But I'm not sure how cold it is because I haven't been out the house. In case I feel a little bougie, I'm gonna throw that on, and then yeah, that is what I'm wearing. I'm gonna carry my Burberry bag, you guys know that's my everyday bag. But without wasting any time, let us go and have breakfast with Hoblimo. I haven't seen her because I've been up and down. One thing about me, I am up and down, so yeah, let's go. I'll see you guys when we get there. It's in Randburg, by the way. I know it's treats you right, but it was okay. I do some stupid, and you still stay with Okay, so we're here. It's one of those spots, man. La Valegile. Do you see that? Those those white people spots. La Valegile. But it's like super cute. The food is great and stuff. Well, I hope. Because all of those spots that have weird places to them, they're cute. So, um, Khomelim was on her way. I took a jacket because it's a bit cold. But if if it's thingy, then I'll let you guys know. Looks like there's a very nice spot off the Lana. I'll just go check it down and show you guys. But yeah, we're at the Fed Zebra. I need a cappuccino, baby. I am you can put a hundred gram on it Anything I said, I stamp on it In a private plane, I lamp on it Let the order call me Guys, let me wipe my screen Breakfast was so cute Breakfast was so cute Khumulima even brought me a cute gift Guys, I, I love it when people say I saw this and I thought of you. Oh, it makes my little heart melt. I can't even take it. So we're gonna go to the mall now. I wanna see which mall. I don't have, do I have to go to the mall? Yeah, I need to go to Food Lovers and I need to go to this game. So we're gonna go to Four Ways. It's raining. I think I'm gonna make oxtail. I wanna make oxtail just my, my, my to my tambo. You know my famous, famous bone soup and there is I think I'm gonna do that. Let me say four ways more because I need so much from the mall. We're going to excuse me. 21 minutes. Head southwest. Okay. We're going to get some skincare. Um, like I told you guys, I need a bit of skincare. There's a restaurant there. Also, Hobelima told me about it. It's so cute. I think their food is absolutely amazing. Um, I'm gonna try. Like this whole street is restaurants. That place was actually very nice. 
this this the fact zebra or zebra and then there's another one called oregano bakery and then there's prawn and then there's this other one so it's just a suite of restaurants and i think there's my vibe guys sometimes going to the same place is boring but anyway um we're gonna drive now um we're going to forwards mall to get some a few things and then i'll see you guys when i get home i'm going out to lunch with tuto let me actually call her because she tried calling me she tried to text the babe it's dinner then is at six. Tuta will ask me something that I already sent her. Like I, I don't understand again. Let me get your favorite fragrance. You got that bomb, huh? I'm trying to detonate you. No disrespect, baby. Just try and make you smile. Try to keep my. But anyway, on the way to Forest Mall, guys. I don't know what to wear. It is raining. It is cold. I don't know what to wear because did I do I have winter clothes? I think I do. I think I do actually. I actually think I do. But I have to check. But I don't have winter clothes. I did buy a lot of jerseys from Barikimang. From from Yo. I think I have a lot of jerseys from Sheen. Like those those big um one with the with the with the neck something like that. So I might find something cute to wear. Just we'll just see when we get home. But I love this weather because it's not hot, it's not cold, and I do have a pair of black. Oh, guys, remember those black boots that I got from Sheen? Oh, oh, oh baby, I'm gonna look cute today. Okay, we'll we'll find it for dawn. Don't, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. Of course, we're at the skin. I am on the skincare aisle. I need some vitamin C. Baby, I need lash glue and I can't see it anywhere. Like, I only use Kiss lash glue and I can't find it here. Like, and I hate asking. Because I'm looking at the lash section, there's no Kiss glue here. Like, oh, let me ask the amount that I spent at this game is physically making me ill. Like, I'm sick, but also, I'm genuinely, I don't know what's wrong. I just went to the ball and I vomited, and I'm in my period right now, so I don't know what the hell is happening. Which part am I at? <laughs> Sorry guys, I am physically ill. Like I went to, I think it's the food, cause I didn't finish. Cause I didn't finish it when we were at that place, the what's what they were. So I think I'm sick from that. But I know how you guys hate it when I vlog at the parking lot, but there's a lot of people here, so don't worry. But I'm on my way to Foy's. Um, Foy's. I'm going to food lovers now because I need juice and everything you guys know I can't live without juice also I was home so there's no groceries in the house um, progress was here so she basically finished and threw out everything I can't always tell her to so we're gonna go to food lovers to get some food we're back home I can't believe how cold it is like it's literally insane how cold it is like I can't believe it I actually can't believe it but um, we're back home <laughs> I'm sorry. Woo! I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. But we're back home. Yo, guys, it's so cold. It's so cold. I broke my nails. But I set up an appointment. Um, I'm getting my lashes done. I miss lashes, guys. Like, I've finally gotten to a point in my life where I cannot live without lashes. So I miss my lashes. Um, I'm getting my lashes done on Wednesday, half past 11. And then I'm going to call Nena so I can go get my nails fixed. I need this color back in my life again, but also it's not practical because it's, it's like, like, I don't know how to explain it, but it's already starting to, you see the, the corners or the edges, I don't know. Did I see that? Yeah, it's already starting to look like that. But these nails, baby, this color is giving. I think I'm going to, do I want to do it again? I think I'm going to do these again. I'm sorry. Like, I love this color. It's soapy, but yeah. Um, I want to show you guys what I got. Guys, I went to this game. Everything cost me 1,080 Rand. Why? Why are you costing 1,080 Rand? For what? 
Like, what are we doing that is costing me a thousand and eighty rands? I didn't get much from Food Lovers. I went to Food Lovers. I didn't get much from them. I just got, guys, I'm so sick. Let me tell you, I'm on my period. Yeah, I'm on my period. And what's this? I don't know if I'm, I'm, I'm having, I'm currently having diarrhea. So I don't know if it's for my, it's for my period or the fact that I ate something because I had hollandaise sauce and I don't know, man, like my, my stomach is just whiling right now currently at this point, but I got, let me tell you what happened. Progress actually made me mad. We actually thought about this. So I bought knickknacks before I left. I told you guys I was home, right? So I bought knickknacks. She was here, right? And I opened them obviously because I knew that I'm going to be home for like two weeks. So when I come back, they're going to be like super stale. So she's like to me, what's wrong with my phone? Oh, the camera's on shit. So she calls me. She's like, Golly, I was hungry and I ate knickknacks. I'm like, you're actually lying. You are actually a liar. Like guys, Progress can eat anything in this house. She knows. She's the one that cleans out the fridge and throws out food that is in the fridge that I haven't eaten because she knows I'm not going to eat it. So when you call me to tell her that you ate knickknacks because you are hungry, it's a lie. You literally could have said, I ate the knickknacks because I wanted to. So her saying she ate it because she was hungry, I'm like, okay. So you couldn't tell me because she came to clean, right? So I'm like, every time she wants to, to have food, she orders it. She tells me she wants me to order something. So I'm just like, progress. Since when are we lying to each other in this house with this family? So now I have to go buy knickknacks again. Because progress clearly likes stale knickknacks. Same food, some cool <laughs> But I don't understand why does she have to lie to me telling me that she's hungry. Whereas she literally could have just said, dog, can I just have knickknacks? Also, you didn't have to ask me. But she knows when it comes to my knickknacks, I'm very, very iffy. So that's why she was she was doing what she was doing. But anyway. Um I got knickknacks. Favorite bulldog. Guys, if this bulldog goes out of I don't know what, if you people finish it, I'm actually gonna kill all of you. <laughs> and then I got um breakfast patch. I got the small one because I'm leaving. So there's no need for me to get big ones. So this guys, I drink like I drink juice like my person, juice and water. And then I've got um the series, what's this mango? And then I got some bananas for my smoothies. I couldn't buy a lot of food because it's pointless. I'm not gonna eat that. So yeah. My progress is gonna come again. She better not tell me about her and I don't know what. Because it's gonna make me mad. And then guys, you know when someone says I got you this because I thought you'd love it. Like, you bought me a gift because you thought I'd like me? I can't believe it. So, Homolima got me. I need to close her address. So, Homolima got me these loafers from Zara. You guys know I don't want cat. Guys, I'm sorry. Am I the only one? But, like, I just feel Zara, like, has, has clothes for people that are there, people. I don't know if I'm making sense, but I just think Zara doesn't make... No, man, when someone says to me, I got this from Zara, I'm like, which Zara did you get it from? I don't know, man, but I, I just have my own personal style. And my own personal style is something also that I feel like I don't want to go out of my way to leave my house. Like, Shane has made it so accessible for me that I don't have to leave my house. Like, I'm so lazy to go and literally shop. Like, that's how crazy it is. So, when someone says Zara, I'm like, hmm. So, she got me these black loafers from zara these were the they almost looked identical identical sorry to the ones that i got from um shane but the shane ones were very small so i gave them away so when i saw these i was like these are so cute i'm definitely gonna make them work not really really my style but i'll try to make them work but just because it's a gift i'm definitely gonna wear these they're so cute i'm gonna look for ways to style them but they are so cute thank you so much my screen I couldn't vlog much when we went to that place, yeah, because it was so packed and it's such a tiny space. Like, it's such a tiny space. And then we get to this trouble that I don't understand this game, guys. I really don't get it, but I'm still there. So I went to go get myself some, this bath, whatever, mate. These gloves, I forgot mine's at my boyfriend's house, so I love them so much. I don't use the scrunch or sponge anymore because I just feel like this leaves my skin so smooth ever since i started using them also because i have long nails i just bought them in front so that my nails can go through but yeah i absolutely love these i got them from this skin and then i got myself the indian turmeric gel um cream mask hydrating um hydrate skin for radiant complexion from freeman 
I've never tried this, but I'm definitely going to because I just want that, you know. My skin must be clean. And then I've got some Hopic from my toilet. Um, some Hopic um, fresh towel from my toilet. And then I got myself new toothbrushes. Guys, I change my toothbrushes every three months. I don't know, maybe that's me, but I definitely change them every three months. I like getting these Colgate ones. Lawa, they're very strong ones. They also, when you're done brushing your teeth, it looks like a crime scene. I love these so much. So, I feel like after three months, they wear out. So, I have to get, like, that's why I don't like the whole, what's that, electronic ones or whatever. Because I just feel like electronic ones are also expensive. And I can't be changing them every three months, but these ones guys i love them so much and it's always the same color it's always blue and pink it's not a boy and girl so i love these so much like i feel like they're fresh every time i use them every time i brush my teeth like listen so love them so much got these and then i got some lash glue from essence it was recommended by that lady that works at the essence stand i hope these do actually work because i use i only use kiss glue and i can't find kiss glue Anyway, I've looked everywhere clicks the skin. I can't find kiss glue. So I was just like, okay, I'm gonna try those It's actually pointless that I bought this because I'm getting my lashes done tomorrow <sighs> So I got myself some lilets. Um Tampons I used the regular pack 32 whatever and then I got new skincare. Yuri H. Maria is the one that put me on on this babe, and I haven't stopped using her. Absolutely love her. Like you guys know, I interchange my skincare every three months to accommodate the new season, the new weather, the new whatever you want to call it. So, um, as you guys know, I use um, what's the one that I use? Estadem. But I interchange. I love Estadem. So I've been stuck with Estadem since last year. But because it's a new season, like I said, I'm going to change and stop using Urage again. So I love their, um, what's this? This is their moisturizer. And then I got, remember when I told you guys that I'm starting with the Garnier Skin Active um, Vitamin C Booster Serum? The first one that I bought was the small one, right? So that I can, like, check how it is on my skin. Guys, when I buy a serum, I have to see how it is on my skin. First, number one. Number two, I have to see if my foundation will... Because when I put my foundation, I normally don't put primer until recently that I started putting the, um, the Rihanna Illuminating, whatever, whatever. But now I have three steps that I do before anything else, which you guys are going to see on the vlog. So I got the bigger one now. Remember, I started with the small one because I was testing it out. My skin absolutely loved her. So I went to go get the bigger one. I'm going to stick with this girl, but I think I'm going to interchange her with the... Um, um, What's that one? The Body Shop um, lights, drops of lights. So drops of lights in this one and the um, Estadem one. They work well and well together. So absolutely love that. And then Progress said I must get a handy and She likes this this um ha I nearly said flavor. She likes the lemon one because my house has the purple one. I don't know what the purple one is called. I think it's lavender. She hates it. She wants this one. So I got this one. And yeah. Why did these things cost me? A thousand and eighty. Are you out of your mind? A thousand and eighty for all. Oh, sorry. And I got my contraceptives. This is the last pack that I'm gonna get for this year because I did them for the three months one. This is the last pack, and then I'm gonna go on the IUD after this. So because I'm done with my what? I'm done with my with my antibiotics. So yeah, this is the last pack. So yeah. I'm gonna put this away. Um, I'm gonna chill for a bit. Me and Tuta are going out to dinner at six. So I'm just gonna chill for now and then maybe take a nap because it's still two o'clock. It's so cold. I think I wanna shower again because I showered in the morning. I just wanna shower again just to be fresh. And then I'm gonna do a get ready with me. And then I don't know if I wanna do it on the vlog because I feel like if it's on the vlog, it's gonna be longer. But if it's on a different video, it's gonna make sense, you know? So yeah, I'm gonna do it though. So, okay, guys, I'll see you um, later when we go have dinner with Tuto. Focus, hey, my loves. It's later on. I just... Oh, there's so much light. Sorry. Sorry, guys, I'm not sure, but... Hey, loves, I just finished filming this Get Ready With Me slash hey reinstall somebody asked me to reinstall this week so i did just that on the video the video is gonna go up tomorrow tomorrow's a tuesday so um yeah that is what i did 
um it's later on it's already six o'clock i'm meeting up with tutor for dinner like i had mentioned so i want to give you guys the trip check record me okay record me <laughs> but um okay let's just start from the top i'm wearing my guys i was looking for the put my right necklace i can't find her i don't know where she is i'm wearing my lv necklace um i'm wearing my she in what's this sheen um earrings and then i am wearing sorry let me just give you guys this side i'm wearing this sheer top that i got from mr i hope you guys can see me i'm wearing the sheer top that i got from mr price i'm wearing my alexa these pants make me look like i don't have a shape but i'm gonna make it work i'm wearing these alexander wang pants you guys remember i got these from pet and then i'm wearing my heels that i got from yo i don't remember where i got these heels from but yo that is my outfit i'm gonna put a cute jacket on top so that I'm not cold for my bag, I'm paying my Gucci Dionysus. And for perfume, I'm going to wear Christian Dua. Christian Dua Dua. Christian Dua. Santal Noyer. I'm not gonna layer this girl because she is so strong by herself. I am not late, I'm on time. So we are going to get going. Um, I'll see you guys when you get there. We are going to Modena. Guys, my hair came out beautiful like I, I didn't anticipate it but it came out amazing so you'll see in the video but with that being said let's not waste any time let us go to Moderna for dinner with Tito I'll see you guys the lighting here is no bad oh it's not bad thank you Tito says my makeup looks nice but the camera itself has good lighting it does Ooh. Hey, how are you doing? <laughs> why did you have lashes what happened they, I have lashes my friend what is this but they're very special they only by the end <laughs> I put the small lashes. What? What's like I cut them. I just wanted like a lifted eye, friend. They're actually so cute. They're cute, right? They're so it's cute. like I have lashes, but I don't have but lashes. But you don't have lashes. Yeah. But they're making your eyes do that face. Yes. I get and you. Like, eh, eh. <laughs> small, small, small something. So we have Moderna. Um, you're looking so cute. Ready? I think we'll even take tops here. But like street. Me, I'm not scared of people looking at me. What are they looking at me for? Like a street. Where else do you want to go? We're actually looking for places to take pictures because I need this. I might not have to take anything. <laughs> why is it so full? Why, is, why are people not in their houses? Because we want to take pictures now. Like it's a holiday. <laughs> can bank on it. You can put a hundred grand on it. Anything I said, I stamp on it. In a private plane, I lamp on it. Let the order to call me bank on it. Cause I walk around with the bank on him Show them Gangnam style, put the gang on him Twist my fingers up on a bang on him Lele ho, lele ho, yeah Tobalo ko macho, yeah Tobalo ma ko macho, yeah Nobody know tomorrow Choro ka choro and if a boy feel macho, make him look red like a tomato. If him not dead, then he call martos. No, go fumble. As the day comes, as I go, God don't watch over me, oh Lord. He's saying, I'm telling you, I'm in love. She's saying, men are trash. But I am in love with the love of my life. Quite interesting, Courtney. Thanks. Interesting take. Okay. So you're gonna be my maid of honor. Okay, it's fine. I don't even like you weddings. guys. I don't go to weddings. You guys see this? Then I'm, I have it on camera. So when the wedding happens by the end of the year, it's just so long. Like why are the service for like the whole day? Like why do weddings take so long? <laughs> Tuta wants us to. Tuta wants us to go to the altar. Yes, yes, I do, I do. Bye. Go home. Go to McDonald's. That's what happens to your weddings. <laughs> Guys, like when I when I do my maid of honor roll call and I'm like, okay, don't say I because this video is proof that Tuta will not be the maid of honor. So, when you are gonna have such a, a high rank title, but because you're a baby bitch, you're not gonna get it. Anymore. I don't know. I get. I don't know how I get married. Okay, you know what? Now it's fine. Because this one is not making sense. It's fucking like rubbish. Rob, I know go feet. I can't even stop. So, to to go into the bathroom and for the first time in my life, 
I actually think I'm gonna have dessert. Guys, I never take it as far as dessert because I hate dessert, but today I'm gonna have dessert. Um, hi, Putty. I'm sorry. Oh, are you gonna come back? Okay, you can put that and come back. So I'm gonna have there is tiram, tiramisu and cake of the day. There's chocolate cake, there's Italian baked cheesecake, and there's red velvet cake. So I think I'm gonna have Italian baked cheesecake. I just saw gelato for scoop. I miss my man so much because we always have gelato. Literally the most crazy thing, but. Cause my neighbors as our day comes as I go God I want you to be on the Lord I cannot trust my neighbors Can I say this is a glass of water? And the bill please Why are you rushing to it? And the milk Guys, Tuto, whenever we ask for dinner She'll be like, friend, do you not think we've been here for long? Now all of a sudden, now we're rushing. Because she knows, she knows she's going to an empty house. I've been alone the whole house. But like, living alone is so crazy, right? Because you can wake up and speak to and no one. <laughs> friend, living alone is the most crazy thing. You wake up and not talk to anybody. No one. Like, it's very crazy. Like, for like 10 hours. 10 hours, don't speak to anyone. Just yeah. look at my face, I'm like, what is this? Just speak like, by yourself. Way. So, hey guys. Um... Today's Thursday. Ah! I just burnt my ear. Today's Thursday. I'm sure you guys are like, what the hell is happening? But uh, I had a very, very bad eye infection. Like my eczema just said, okay, you know what? We are done. We are done with you. We are done with this whole thing. We just want to be free. <laughs> so. It just flared up. I didn't know what the hell to do. So I went to the doctor. And I'll show you guys some pictures. Um, and then after that they gave me. They gave me antibiotics. Sorry. They gave me antibiotics and meds. Just to just to calm it down. Because it was swollen. So on Monday it was fine. Remember Monday I went to dinner with Tuto. And then Tuesday when I woke up. I it was a mess. That's when I was like okay. I'll just, I'll just use eye drops. So I was like I, I'll use eye drops. Wednesday, uh, ten past four. Exen, Lisa Silva, Lily Lingag, especially this one. So I was just like, ah, no way. So I went to the doctor and they gave me antibiotics and they're like, okay, your eczema is filling up, but there's also something that is causing it. Did you wash your makeup brushes? Blah blah. So I came home, washed my makeup brushes, washed everything, got rid of things that I think that have expired. My mascaras. I got rid of literally almost half of my makeup collection. So. I hope my eyes gonna be fine now but yeah that was that's that was why I haven't vlogged for two days but I'm back but I'm not gonna put any makeup on my face right now until I feel like I'm okay I'm only wearing lashes because I have to do a hair review which I'm currently doing right now and I was just like uh -uh, let me just wear lashes so that I look kind of sort of presentable but yeah that's what's been happening and I also saw you guys have been literally sending me DMs about something that Kay said about youtube and the youtube space and stuff guys i feel like i've told you already that there's not much money on youtube especially in south africa that's why there's boys on the side i did tell i didn't lie about it you know um of course you can make money on youtube but i wanted yeah when i sit down and i said i want to show you guys how much in a typical month i'll make but i just don't want to be on any blogs or anything because other people will perceive it as bragging or something like that so I was just like, I'm not going to say anything, but let me tell you, look, YouTube is lucrative and I feel like especially in America it is, but in South Africa, honestly, <laughs> I just think that it's a lie. Like in South Africa, it's honestly a lie. Like I'm just like, mm -mm. we're not making as much and I understand where K comes from. And mind you, Kay has big numbers than I have. I feel like if she was a bit consistent, she'd actually see, like, the money actually come in. But when she said that she had a conversation with somebody from America, I had a conversation as well with somebody from America. And also, I don't know if you guys watch Clemazonte. I watch Clemazonte, um, her YouTube channel, 
right sorry this thing didn't hold i watched glamour's on Tay's youtube channel on i think it was two vlogs back she was telling us how much she made guys she made 20 i think it's she made she makes rather twenty thousand us dollars on i think it was one video or something like that that is 368,000 rands. Do you understand me? 368,000 rands. So I'm just like, we don't make as much, guys. We really don't make as much. I feel like if you want to be in the YouTube space, you have to actually love it. You have to actually wake up and be like, I love doing this. And I'm not going to lie to you. With me, I love doing YouTube because, yes, I do make money. Because also, I do hair reviews. So I'm making a prime example, not that I, I, I charge. If you're going to charge a company like $200 for a hair review, right? You charge them $200, they pay you $200, how much? Wait, let me Google. Um, maybe like 4K? Is it, wait, let me go. $200 is, hi bo, I think my other phone is that side and this phone is so slow. My, my other phone is charging. So this one is very, very slow. Um, okay, two hundred dollars in rents. Cutting rails for what? Oh, Banza. This hair is so gorgeous. I can't wait to see how the bangs are gonna come out. But hey, okay, let's just say two hundred dollars is 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 three thousand, right? You already have three thousand rand, and then plus the people. Who go and watch your channel right the people that are going to watch are gonna add to 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 the thing the, the actual video and then if you decide I will I don't want to keep this hair you are selling the hair that's more money for you and then maybe you sell the hair for 2,000 you already have 3,000 from charging the hair company and then you make an additional 3,000 from selling the hair that's 6,000 so imagine you do this um, you have four videos so two four six eight Eight, no, five videos. Five, two, four, six, eight, ten. How one thousand dollars, and then you sell all of these weeks for three thousand. Three, six, um, twelve, fifteen. What's this? Eighteen. So you already have eighteen thousand. You do make money. You get what I'm saying. You do make money. So I don't know if you guys have noticed. There's days or there's there's times where I'll upload two vlogs in one um in one month and maybe one sit down and then hair reviews and then you guys will be like oh you're uploading every time it's not really uploading every time but i'm just multitasking to be like okay vlogs hair reviews and like normal videos you get me so um for me personally my youtube journey has been a very publicized one because of how fast i got to a thousand subscribers i don't know guys i just felt like it was my time the lord made it possible for me i'm sorry like if that sounds cliche perfectly normal that's fine but i just felt like for me personally it was my time to shine i'm not gonna lie to you for me it was my time to shine like the lord said i bet you have you have wanted this for a long time it's time for you to have it because i didn't struggle guys i didn't struggle i started making money um i think after the first month it's just that I hadn't received my, my AdSense um, thingy, my AdSense pin and stuff like that. But I started making money in the first month because you're supposed to have a thousand um, followers and a thousand watch hours, I think, something like that. So I had all of those those in the first month. So for me, that's why I'm saying YouTube was very easy, was a calling for me because like the Lord was just like, I, it's, it's your time to shine, you know. So if you want to be in the YouTube space, guys, you have to understand that you won't make money. When I sit and I look at the people that have like maybe 800 subscribers, um, bless your heart, 800 um, subscribers and there's like 100 views. And that person is not like quitting. You have to give them props, guys, because Utole Utu, their RPM is like 10 rand, not even 10, like 3 rand. And in one video, they make maybe 15 rand. Do you know how demotivating that is? Unfortunately, I mean, sorry, fortunately for me, I didn't have to experience that because, like I said, my YouTube career just went from zero at a thousand, you know? So I didn't have to fight for views. I didn't, and it's not like I'm saying people are fighting for views, but I didn't have to do a lot, guys. Like, I think maybe the fact that people had already, like, been waiting for me to be in the YouTube space, that kind of, like, sort of helped. But I didn't have to do much, trust me. I really didn't have to do much. Like, do you, when you watch American YouTubers, do you see them posting every day? Do you see them posting three vlogs in, in one week? No, they don't because they're making money, these people, guys. They really are. 
like youtube is is a side hustle for them i don't want to lie to you so if you're gonna be in south africa and you want to do youtube trust me you have to do it because you love it don't do it because you think you're rushing for the money the money's not gonna come now trust them because the money's not gonna come now if it does hooray for you but hey that's why i even saw shadow um Karabo left youtube she's now on tiktok fully on tiktok um i don't know how you people make money on tiktok but also have you realized that if people are on instagram they hardly on youtube i'm gonna make a prime example like you see i'm gonna make a promise like lanzi lanzi is full blown on instagram they do the makeup videos on instagram they do whatever on instagram they don't really have to be posting on youtube because i'm almost certain one paycheck from youtube they do it with one post on instagram do you get what i'm saying i don't have to vlog for a whole freaking week for me to make money whereas i can post one picture and i make money do you get what i'm saying so i get sometimes people are that's why people are inconsistent on youtube because they can make what they make on one post with me i'm not big on instagram you guys have noticed that i really am not big on instagram i don't care much for instagram that's why maybe brands aren't approaching me to do like instagram content because i really really don't care much for instagram but youtube i absolutely love youtube because my check comes from youtube like the hair reviews and also i just feel like there's a gratification that i get from doing like videos i love i love vlogging guys and for me honestly i just feel like it's memories if i may because one day i'll be sitting whereas um when or i decide to quit youtube or i decide to to just focus on my family or whatever at that present moment and i'm sitting in my house i can go back to my videos and just watch them and be like damn this is what i used to do it's different from pictures you can look at pictures but with youtube you're watching yourself in that moment and you know you're having fun with your friends i'm gonna look back on all of this, these videos i'm gonna be like oh my god i had the time of my life Do you get me so it's almost like memorabilia for me honestly i don't want to lie to you whenever my kids want to watch what their mom was up to you know it's that type of situation so if you're gonna do youtube please do it because you love it because the numbers and the money is not gonna come like that it's definitely not it's gonna take time do you get me so you must just do it because you actually do love it and it gives you some form of joy you love vlogging personally i love vlogging i'm not gonna stop vlogging i might my content might be not consistent at a point in my life whereas when um i decide to i don't know when i have a family or something like that my content may be slow but i really do love vlogging like i'm not gonna lie to you guys vlogging is it just gives me it just gives me joy there's nothing in this life that gives me joy than vlogging i don't want to lie to you nothing nothing makes me happy than vlogging so that's why i'm not gonna stop now i'm definitely going to keep vlogging for the longest time i'm gonna be on youtube for the longest time because i be personally for me guys i don't think i'm a beauty content creator like your other babes like i'm gonna make an example like your zx's on lines your 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 case in them i'm not gonna go and do a reel where i show you how to do your makeup no i'm not gonna do that so that's why they don't care much for youtube because they make their money from instagram do you get me so yeah if you want to be in this space guys make sure that you're mentally prepared for it and monetary prepared for it because you won't make money from the get-go you know so youtube is just a very wild space like the american babes are making money that's why they can put one vlog out. Well, Maria Musa, they put one vlog out in, in a month. Then they come back, life updates. That life updates, it's not even making sense because that person was just out living the best life, going on vacations because they don't have to work hard, guys. They really don't have to work hard because they're busy posting on Instagram. Instagram has more money than YouTube. I'm not going to lie to you. What you do on YouTube with two videos, you can do on Instagram with one post. Do you get me? This one time, when I did the campaign for, for, what's this, the perfume brand, I think I even stayed without posting for like two weeks because I was good for that month. So with me, like I said personally, I don't really care much for, for Instagram, that's why I'm always on YouTube, because YouTube makes me happy. I love vlogging, vlogging makes me happy. So yeah, pick, pick, pick your battles, guys, and... K is absolutely right. There's no, there's not that much money, especially if you don't have that much followers. Do you get me? So I think that's why people go to the extremes of wanting to trend, you know, and saying crazy hectic things just for views so that they can get subscribers. Do you get me? 
so yeah i think with me also when i first started that was my approach until i saw with the, I, I really don't want people in my life like that so a lot of things did change and i just started doing like other content you get me so yeah um what's this i'm gonna i'm gonna open this hair this is for the hair review i'll just talk to you guys when i'm done this hair is giving i'm a grown-ass woman and i can do whatever the hell i want you know it's giving i think i want to layer it and add like bigger curls because i feel like i'm gonna like it poofy but i'm living i am absolutely living like i'm living i'm living i just need to master how to do my bangs properly i'm gonna go on tiktok don't worry but um i am feeling so much better my eyes are so much better i said there's no i'm gonna be in this damn house i've been in this i've been confined to this establishment <laughs> to this psychiatric ward for two days i said there's no way so i'm feeling a bit better i'm like let me go have myself is it brunch breakfast what is it i'm craving a mimosa so i might just go get a mimosa have brunch have you know something i feel cute i look cute i'm gonna show you guys my fit now check and yeah you know get out of this funk that i'm feeling i might just go Mm -mm. i'm not going to do diamond rock no you are not going to do it <laughs> i have suffered for two days i feel like i can literally like you know be like ah, uh -uh, i need diamond rock you know no i actually don't stop you actually don't need diamond rock. but okay i'm not gonna go to diamond rock because i know i'm gonna come up with a perfume a bag let's not do that so but um yeah i feel better thank god and yeah that's it so i'm just gonna quickly oh drip check sorry i forgot so hey i thought i had lost exhibit guys i thought i had lost exhibit but i'm wearing these earrings from sheen go get exhibit now she's from sheen i'm wearing my bottega shades um i don't know, remember where the top is from but yeah i'm wearing this cute um long sleeve top because i don't know what the weather's like i'm wearing uh, like leggings those ones that i showed you guys on the previous vlog where i did the small Diana sheen haul and i'm wearing my lv slides i'm gonna carry my Burberry bag as you guys know that is my everyday bag so yeah also um i'm getting a tattoo done if you guys are new here then you will know that um this hand this one the finger tattoos um i had gotten them off of um i saw them on pinterest right and i was like i like them i really really do like them and i want to do them not realizing that the whole fucking world has this tattoo also to find out that Aaliyah's face has this tattoo and then now there was just people talking about oh, you're copying Aaliyah's face you're copying everything she does you're copying her vlogs and i'm just like that is actually crazy i don't think you guys um if you guys remember i i did go to lifa and then he was like, he can't cover it up because of one, two, three, one, two, three, whatever. And I was like, okay, I'm going to find somebody to cover it up. But also, I want to cover up that, not that not everybody has, because guys, the only thing that, honestly, with tattoos that nobody else will have is a significant um, name or date of birth or whatever, whatever. But when it comes to designs such as flowers, such as anything, obviously, that is design, you're going to find it somewhere. So I was like, okay, let me cover this up with a rose. So I'm going to get myself a rose. Um, it's going to be upside down. So the, the, the thing is going to be down here, the actual rose. And then the stem is going to go up. I'm not sure, but yeah, I'm going to get myself a rose. Because I feel like this is what makes it be like, oh, that's her tattoo. I don't want that. So with this, anybody can get these. But with this one, it's very significant. You can literally see that, oh, it looks like hers. I don't want that for myself. Because people are like, yeah, you got it because of her. I really didn't. I did, Like, when I first got this tattoo, I was not watching Aaliyah. After when I found, because someone made it, like, brought it to my attention. It's like, oh, this tattoo is the same as Aaliyah's. I was like, who the hell is Aaliyah? That's when I started watching. I was like, oh, this girl is actually dope. And I was watching a vlog and I was like, shit, we have the same fucking tattoos. You know, obviously she had it first. And then from there on, I was just trying to, like, cover it up and stuff like that. So, that's when I got my hand one. And then, now I'm going to get this one. I'm going to just cover this part because, like I said, everybody can get these things. Everybody can get, like, these lines and stuff like that. But with this one, it's very significant. You can see that, oh, it looks like hers. So, I'm just going to cover this part and get it this over and done with because I'm over with the whole thing. People are going to make a hoo-ha after I explain myself. But because with me, it's just sitting on my... Because I'm sure a new subscriber will be like... 
I know the tattoo from somewhere and now I'm just gonna be like I have to explain again so I don't want to do that so I'm gonna get this covered today maybe get a few more things I don't know guys I'm I'm done with tattoos actually I'm just gonna get this one covered and I'm done okay I'm done I'm done but also I kind of sort of like it but also I just I just don't want that whole thing over my head so yeah um yeah that's it and then we'll see how the day progresses but for now let's just go have brunch or breakfast i don't know i don't know what time it is so if it's breakfast or brunch i don't know but we'll see but i've, I've said a mouthful this is what happened when i don't vlog for two days like i come back in and it's a she gave me so i'll see you guys wherever i'm gonna i'm gonna see which breakfast spot we're gonna go to Anyway, I'm at Jameson Square. I've I've come here. Before. Ooh, I've come here, ma'am. Surely I can't speak today. I've been here before. I boo. I've been here before with Tuto. We came for breakfast. I absolutely. I don't know what that place is called, but it's next to the post office. Post next to post office. Oh, the food there is immaculate. So I was like, let me come here for breakfast because my tattoo parlor is on my way from here. Bangsuga Langia corner. So it's very close. So I was like, uh-huh. I'm feeling cute. I'm feeling nice. Let me just go and have breakfast. Just take my <laughs> So I'm going to this place called the pantry. It's in Danefin Square. If you're ever in Danefin Square, you should come to the pantry. Absolutely love their food. So I'm going to the pantry. You're to say because you're And I'm But yeah, let's go to the pantry, have breakfast. It doesn't look full. I brought my laptop with me because I was like, I don't want to look like I'm not doing anything. So in the midst of me eating, I'm gonna get in some work because in the morning I did a, a review. Guys, this hair is giving grown woman, man. Oh, I love it here. This is my new favorite like, get up and go wig. Love it so much. And it feels like it's a double drawn, and I don't even I'm not even sure if it's a double drawn, but anyway. Um I need to put on some perfume. I didn't put perfume. I'm gonna put it outside the car because Ion Kama. I was contemplating vlogging because people are looking at me, but I was just like, actually, I'm never gonna see you again, so mind <laughs> your damn business. So I just got to the pantry. I'm about to eat. I just ordered a mimosa, and I'm busy on my laptop, so yeah, I'm minding my business. I'm about to have food, and oh, I'm obsessed with this hair. It's giving very much growth. Sure. Guys, I, I, I don't know, hey? 
Like, am I asking for too much or what is going on? tomato gravy with an egg honestly I'm not gonna lie to you but it's actually really nice and fresh mm -hmm. not bad guys my arms are so sore I think it's because I've been sleeping like for the past two days so okay I'll turn right now doll thank you so my arms are a bit painful I don't know what's happening so I think I need to I might have to go see shot I'm joking. But yeah, I think I need to go see Shushan because my arms are on fire. But, guys, I don't know. Like, am I used to a specific type of shakshuka or have I tasted a specific type of shakshuka that everywhere I go, there's a different one and I always... I think it's time I make my own because I'm just like, every single shakshuka that I taste is weird, you know? But yeah, it was... Uh, it felt like yeah when I'm outside force name it felt like I'm over force I don't want to lie to you. it felt like it felt like my tamatisi and I can just take out pap and uh, and just add force and call it a day that's that's what it felt like but it was absolutely amazing I think the feta because they put feta cheese on top oh my god delicious so now I'm on my way to get my tattoo done good morning good morning good morning good morning I'm so excited I'm so happy I'm so happy because yesterday I got the fight. We got the final. Let me say we we got the. Ugh. My eyes are getting better. The sun is starting again. This girl is a problem. I put the ointment. You guys see, this girl is a problem, but we'll be fine. But yesterday I got the. Um, we got the video for what we're working on. I think I can finally tell you guys because obviously it is going live today. I am the new. We apparently they don't call us brand ambassadors, they call us regals. I am part of the regals of Shiva's regal family. Ah! <laughs> so, like I said, it's a brand ambassador type of situation, but they don't call it that. They call it the re they call us the regals. So it's me, Bobby Blanco, Garnet Blue, um, Benny Chill, Benny Maverick, and Robot Boy. So you guys remember when we did the whole shoot, everything is finally out. Um, it's currently nine o'clock. I just ordered breakfast. I didn't, <clears throat> I was in the mood to um, cook and stuff. So I wanted to show you guys. I hope you can see it. Let me just put you guys here. I wanted to show you guys the, um, it's, it's out. It's, well, it's gonna be out at 12 o'clock. This is just sending me five messages. It's not me. <laughs> it's not me. But um, oh guys, I literally was crying yesterday when I saw this. Um, let me show you. Why is my phone on thingy? Cause it's gonna, it's you. You guys are gonna see it regardless. Like today, today is Friday, Friday the fourteenth. So here it is. Let me show you. It's never been about just getting to the top. Sorry. It's never been about just getting to the top. It's about the how. How do I remain real as I grow? Even though I'm on my way there. It feels good to know that I'm not alone. Shared success always tastes better. Bibanini! <laughs> In many talents, different flavors. Our wins are collective. Here's to every victory one. Together. Together. Here's, Here's to the, the real, real ones. ones. Be real. You yeah. regal. Guys, I've been beaming. Like I've been beaming. What's the la? Like I've been beaming. Like oh my, even oh my god. Okay, relax. Oh. But I've been beaming with so much, like joy and pride. You guys know I hardly do like any campaigns. I hardly do uh, masters. And I'm not gonna lie to you. It's not that um uh, masters. A lot of the campaigns, it's always because I'm I'm gonna be completely honest with you. A lot of the campaigns, it's always that thing of, um, yeah, the things that you used to say on Twitter, 
if anybody had to go in and and look for them blah 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 they back and i'm just like that was me before but also you have to understand that some of the things that i said on twitter were misquoted or mis what this there were I, I didn't use my words properly, especially the one about... I don't even want to go back to it because I don't want to revisit or relive it again. But there's just so many things that make brands not want to work with you. So the ones that do actually want to work with me, I'm just like, oh, this is actually cool that you really do want to work with me and your brand. Um, despite what people say, and I think that's why I live Twitter because I'm very vocal and sometimes when people like do come for me, I do say things that... I do regret because I'm a, I'm a guys when you come from I, I act like this so I just yeah that's another reason why I'm, I'm well off without it so I'm so excited oh I was crying yesterday I remember calling my aunt calling my man and he was like he's so proud of me so yeah guys and in as much as I can say that I'm, I'm proud of myself I'm proud of us some people may think this is a cliche or some shit, but I'm proud of us in the sense of a whole, my subscribers and me. Like you guys have been riding with me since day fucking one, yeah. And I wouldn't have this life without you. Let me tell you, you are the bosses of my life. Like <laughs> you are the freaking bosses of my life, and that's just that. So I'm eternally grateful for you guys. Um, my time is now it's nine. Electricity is gonna leave at 12 o'clock, but obviously I have an inverter, so <laughs> um, I'm gonna post at 12. Um, everything is ready. I'm super excited. So once again, thank you guys. Thank you for riding with me. I'm so hungry. I'm about to eat now. And also, I am here to tell you that I have migrated from Miami at my my great my great so is that the good word to use i have moved from miami Archer. i am not with miami Archer anymore i'm with att <laughs> or whatever that is but i don't eat miami Archer anymore i don't eat any other acha but mango acha from food lovers baby my armpits don't smell i think in elvig my armpits don't smell and I'm just like, finally, finally. Obviously, when I'm home in Nelsford, I'm going to eat that other one that I love, love, love. Oh, my God. Don't play with that. Don't play with it. But finally found my fave. Mango, food lovers, mango, food lovers, mango, acha, pickled in an aromatic spice blend. Hot. This is the one. Screenshot if you want. My armpits have not smelled. And mind you, I don't use Micham or whatever. I use, um, what is this? I use Dove deodorant. So, my armpits, I was so strict. Guys, I love, I, I can't stay without. I eat through every single thing. So, I'm finally happy that I can eat it for the rest of my life. But I'm going to charge my battery because it's a bit low. I want to make a smoothie now, watch some TV, um, upload that. And then after that, when my battery's charged, I'm going to show you guys how to curl the hair. You guys have... DM'd me, have sent me messages. I am going to curl the hair and show you guys how I do it. I swear to God. So it's very easy. A lemon. And remember, the curls, the, the, the rollers that I used were the ones from the previous vlog. I showed you guys the Shane Ho where I bought you guys clothes. It's that one. So if you just go, I, th I did link it, right? So if you go and buy those rollers and then just literally follow all the steps I'm going to show you guys. Perfect. So let me eat quickly, charge my battery, and then I'm going to start filming. <laughs> my, my video just went up. Oh my god. No, it went up like two hours ago. Sorry, it went up like two hours ago. But because obviously, I went to go take a nap after that. But it's up. Oh my god. Thank you guys so much for the congratulations. From the for the congratulations for the for the everything man i'm 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 truly grateful like i'm so i'm so speechless at the love obviously i know i expected it because one thing about my darlings they will freaking ride for me i need to remove this um sorry i need to remove this i'm removing the this one i want to put this one they just delivered something to my house now by the way but um thank you oh, wait let me just put it in quickly 
Yeah, the guy just left. I just delivered this now. I don't know what it is, so I just want to open it and get it. But, um, thank you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for everything. These glasses have been helping me with my eyes. And bless their hearts. Thank you guys so much for everything. I truly appreciate it. Like, from the bottom. And I mean, bottom of my damn heart. This means so much to me. You guys have no idea. When I was keeping it from you guys, I was just like, I can't do this. I need to share that with him. But now, now it's live. So, yeah. To, 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 an, to a beautiful and amazing working ambassador life with with our faves, Shiva's Regal. Um, Natal was taking me out to celebrate. Um, yeah, Natal and my friends are taking me out to celebrate. This is so dark. I wish tattoos could stay like this for the rest. <gasps> oh, sorry, for the rest of our lives. But yeah, we're going out to celebrate later and eternally grateful, man. Eternally grateful. But yeah, um, I had, I had, I had, I have a delivery. It's written L'Oreal, so I don't know what it is. Lancome? It's from Lancome. Um, new and improved Taint Adult Ultra Way. What is this? Oh, foundation! Lancome Taint Adult Ultra Way. Dear Golly, you reach a new level of breathtaking. What? Of breathability. Oh, breathability with our most tested, trusted, and loved foundation ever. Get ready to elevate your long wear and leave your skin free to move. Oh, you guys remember on the vlog where we went to the, um, to the thingy? To da, to do, to da, to da, to da, truth or da. If you watch cartoons, you'll know what I'm talking about when I say truth or da. But um, when we went to the um, event here in Lancome, they took our, um, they took our, our match they matched our thingies man to the foundation so i think this is it oh <laughs> given this cute little package um how cute is this lancome this is the color 450 yes i remember 405w this is the one that i i got tested and it looked exactly like me so you know what that means? It's time for it's time for a get ready with me. Oh, it even looks like me. So I'm gonna do a get ready with me today, guys. I am loving get ready with me's because you guys are loving them as well. Um, I'm gonna do the foundation review today, and I'm gonna do it with you guys. So yeah, I think let's have a say she's coming over because she doesn't have electricity. So I'm not sure yet. Let me actually call her. Because it's already one o'clock. She said dinner's at six. She didn't have. What's her phone now? No, I don't it. But yeah, guys. Um, I am going to. I'm going to um do my am I do, Yeah, it's one o'clock now. Electricity only is coming back. At, is only coming back at four. So. Am I gonna do the hair now? Cause I'm supposed to show you guys how I do my bendy rollers, right? So I don't know if I should do it now or do it tomorrow. Should I do it tomorrow? Yo, I'm so conflicted, but yeah. Cause right now I wanna do something else, but it's... okay, let's see how my day pans out, but cause there's still ample time. Hey loves, it is later on in the day. No, later on at night, actually. And I'm about to go out. Yo, there's so much I didn't do because electricity decided that it's going to come back at 5. And I had anticipated it to come back at 4. I couldn't do a hair review. I had to wear my old... You know what? Nah, but it's fun. Uh, my house is a bit messy. Please forgive me because I've been just doing the absolute most. But, trip check. I hope you guys can see me. I am wearing this top from Sheen. These cargo pants are from, like this outfit is sponsored by Sheen. I should say this video is sponsored by Sheen, but because they play with me, they play with me. Um, these pants, Sheen, my shoes are from, literally, Sheen has me on a troll cold, and I'm going to carry this gold bag from Sheen. Guys, please don't mind my fan. Like, like I said, it's a very busy day in this house. This bag is from Sheen. And for perfume, 
I'm going to wear um who is this Tom Ford Velvet Orchid because this girl does not need you to put her with anybody and then for earrings I'm wearing my Valentino earrings Fendi necklace and just a jewelry um, we are going to Saint we had reservations at Marvel but because of what happened with the electricity also the table's dress that was a bit of a malfunction but no need to worry so I'll see you guys when we get to Saints it's the second time I go to Saints I don't know if you guys remember for my 26th birthday I was at Saints with um, my friends so yeah I'll see you guys when we get there come to take pictures if I don't get pictures in this fit I'm going to lose my damn mind let's just start there okay thanks <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I can't believe for so we are searching the whole mall for pictures. Guess who just said those shorts? What shorts? You, you. What's it, those shorts? Hey, it's many words. Guys, we are at the mall looking for a place to take pictures because we need pictures. Also, we're supposed to go to Saints. Saints was fully booked. We went to Zoo. Zoo was fully booked. So we're just gonna go to a pair, chill, and be merry. Nothing is happening. Smash yana smash. Hey. Smash yana smash. Hey. Hong this now. Yeah. Ooh, don't Ooh, that one's giving. Okay. Ooh. Oh, nice. My name is Nanta Waso. <laughs> so we are getting very worried. <laughs> so what's that motion for listen? Does it how much is this? 24 reds. For and you know how much is this? Oh, on, really? Are you, okay? <laughs> Are you okay? Really? It's either you kill me or not. What is that? Cool, my gun. That's because I can't go to. Some crush, I know go to the metrics. Yum, gosh. You guys are like girl miss girl girl sorry i'm in my i just woke up i just arrived actually i just arrived from ghana um you can see my bag is there <laughs> i literally just arrived and i was just like I need to finish this damn vlog sorry before you guys actually hate me like you guys actually hate me you guys have been DMing me and be like are you okay I'm definitely fine oh the light me so much time I'm okay um I just I don't know this is the first vlog ever in the history of the lighting is shit let me just try it this is the first vlog ever in the vlogging history of the darlings on the sex so that a vlog takes for so long for me to upload but um what's this i traveled um i traveled as you guys can see i just arrived i traveled but we back i don't know what this is but yeah i traveled we back and the last time i vlogged i was going out with latavo and tando and we were having a little celebration for Tando's birthday and my um what's this my 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 Shiva's Rigo um ad right so we were out having fun guys the camera is the last thing on my mind because I was having She can't wait to move from this place. The camera was the last thing in my mind because I was having so much fun with my friends and we were celebrating each other and stuff like that. So that's why I didn't vlog much. I'm so sorry about that. 
but um yeah it was such a fun night we went out went to opera later i came back home so drunk i was finished i don't remember the last time i had champagne and not just one but three bottles so i was finished so i came back home passed the fuck out and then woke up later not later sorry woke up the next morning i had a flight to catch so yeah but i couldn't finish the vlog and i can't just finish the vlog the way i just the way it was like that because i promised you guys that i'm gonna curl my hair with you so yeah i'm gonna finish the vlog today um we're gonna go i need to buy groceries you guys know whenever i come back from traveling i'm gonna buy i buy groceries and stuff like that and then um what's this i'm gonna show you the hair but i'm not gonna show you the black one because on tuesday i'm going to lunch with mpo so i want to wear my red hair i haven't worn red hair in a minute sorry is it red they call it 99j but i just say red hair but it's the maroon hair i haven't worn that wig in a minute so i want to do that that's how i'm going to show you guys how i curl my hair and my tattoo is healing by the way i love that it's just a dark um what's this just the dark thing that covers the one thing that i wanted so bad to go it's still healing i really like that doesn't have to make sense to anybody but me because that thing you could see i have somebody's tattoo that everybody knows is just lingering over my head i just hated that part so yeah i'm fine i finally covered it up but my boyfriend like you need to stop getting any tattoos on your hand because i was just like this this this, this was literally the last one because i just wanted to get that memory off my head because i have um alia faces tattoo and that was not my intention ever so yeah because people are like yeah everything you do is an adjacent to her content and i'm just like okay <laughs> i didn't know that my every move you guys are calculating it and you know so i just don't want that thing over like hovering my head so i really like my new tattoo it's really cute like i said it's a black flower it's a black rose so it doesn't have to make sense to anybody but me and i love it and it's healing so yeah that's what we're doing today groceries and then we're gonna go to this game i need to get some makeup because i'm gonna film a get ready with me full drugstore makeup get ready with me you guys have been loving the get ready with me so have i also i need to film a lancome um first impression so there's a lot there's a lot that we're doing also saturday we're going to durban for my first brand trip that is actually insane i'm going to durban for a brand trip I'm going to do it for Shiva's Regal. I'm so happy. And then, yeah, enough blabbering. I was just catching up with you guys what happened for the whole week, what happened, and I'm here now. And, yeah, I got my nails done. Let me show you. I got my nails done. Like, I just... Guys, this is, like, this is my new... Not shape, but I don't... I didn't put cuticle oil. You I, I need to go put cuticle oil. But I just went shorts again because I felt like those... The, the, the chrome ones they have grown out like my nails have had grown out so i was like i'm going back to short nails and i love this this is just um there they are yeah so simple french nothing hectic short back again love that for me okay enough blabbing let's go to the mall i'm going to forward more i wanted to go and have a massage by shushan because i was traveling but i'm lazy to drive to certain also i feel like i'm setting myself up if i do go to certain because i'm definitely going to end up at somewhere buying i don't even want to say the name but yeah enough blabbing i'll see you guys when we get to i'm going to food lovers market so food lovers market and then but i'm going to start at this game then food lovers market then we, i'll see you guys in i'm at four is more i parked by the woolly side because i really just want to pass by when i'm done with my shopping this game is so far when i'm here but it's the walk i'm willing to take because i need to come back to place when i'm done also i did the most adult thing today i took the what do you, what do you call those things the ashkana i'm not supposed to vlog here the security is really looking at me see you guys i don't know how but i made it to fashini there's a bit of a hype around Fushini lately, so I was like, let me see what's happening. Let me see what's what people are talking about. And I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie to you, the clothes are really, really cute. Like really cute. I'm seeing some really cute stuff that I might like and I'm gonna get. So I'm just still looking around and then just like these pants, we're gonna keep these pants on. It's like cargo pants. What are these? 
Yeah. yeah. So there's some pretty cute stuff. Also, there's kids stuff. There's shoes. I saw tops, really. I want to go check their, their makeup. This one is okay. me weird vlog. Well, I don't care because I'll never see her again in my life. So you'll see me, but I won't see you. <laughs> so I'm just going to look around and then I'll see what I like. I don't know if you guys remember. I told you guys that there's this Foshini lash that I have. It's called Color Mates. I bought it from Foshini. So now I'm asking them if they do have the Color Mates. They said they don't um, do Color Mates anymore. But they do have a new range called All Women. Let me show you. So this is their new range. It's not Color Mates anymore. It's called All Women. And this is like their yeah, eyeshadow collection and stuff. I just saw this blue one. Unfortunately, I hate, absolutely hate color on my lips now. But this is 59 Rand. It's called Runway Queen. This blue is insane. Like, it is so bright. I mean, if I were to buy eyeshadow, I'm almost certain I'd buy this one. But the purple is throwing me off because you guys know I don't like wearing um, eyeshadow anymore. But there's like a wide range of them. And you guys can't do get all of them. Of course I want to get lip liner because I just want Among Fagalelo Nami are really really very red. But yeah. Um if you are keen on buying makeup, affordable makeup, what is this? Foshini Velvet Matte Lipstick. Is this a red? This is a red. It looks very nice. I'm not gonna buy it though. <laughs> Um, for Shiny Max, it's another matte red. So they have a few selections. I mean, I would love to, to, to show you, but hey, my skin is skinning these days. I don't want to ruin it. So I found the makeup side. Sorry, the the okay, this is the perfect matte foundation. How much is this? How much is this? Unfortunately, they don't have prices on them, guys. So this is the perfect matte foundation, and then this is a foundation stick for 99 rand. This is a primer, skin perfecting makeup primer. This is another foundation. I think this is a mattifying compact powder. There is just a lot, and then you come this side. What is this? Hey, gorgeous. Hey, gorgeous. Kima. Oh, okay. <laughs> hey, gorgeous is something else. But yeah. You guys can come here and facial scrub. Okay. I've never seen hey, gorgeous. Hey. It looks like it's a Cape Town brand because it's the 021 number. Okay, these are face masks. But yeah. Okay, let's leave this place. What are we doing here if you may ask i'm looking for um what is this okay this is page prada this might go well with my when i'm sitting my makeup so what is this color Hi, Isana. There's no color here. Nude beige. I think this is the one. We're at Woolies. I'm gonna do a few more grocery runs and then we're gonna go to Food Lovers. I don't even know if I wanna go to Food Lovers anymore because I'm just like already at Woolies. Do you get me? And uh, so tonight will be the night that I will fall for you. <laughs> I can't, like, every single time I see someone with her hair, I lose my mind. Because tonight will be the guys, I love that song so much. <laughs> I love that song so much. But I'm back. 
<laughs> we went grocery shopping. I don't know why I bought so much groceries, but yeah, we went grocery shopping. And I can almost assure you that this is literally the same thing. I'm so proud of myself. I took these from home. Like, so proud of myself. But anyway, let us um, get into this. Uh, what did I buy? Okay, so let's go. Yeah. So, I got myself some woolies for banana muffins. I absolutely, you guys, I absolutely love these ones. Like, if you know me personally, you know. I know you guys never see this because I always go buy them and then I eat them up at the same time. So, I know. I'm sure you guys are going to be like, what? And I got these. Absolutely love these. Like, I know the fla the, the thing, it's kiwi, apple, and pear. But I feel like if I were to buy the ingredients myself, I could never be able to get them right. So that's why I got these. They were 3 for 78 grand, I think. So I got these. And then I got myself some creamy Swiss chard and honey butternut with the hint of cinnamon. Um, the what's the spinach and the honey. I'm sorry, and the cinnamon meal. I'm not in the mood to cook. The only thing I'm going to make is wings. And maybe a side of rice, like a little bit of rice. So I got myself some classic potato salad as well. And then I got myself, this is the first time I tried this. This is smoky four bean salad and mix of beans and sweet corn. It looks like acha. That's why I think that's why I got it. But this is the first time I tried this. So you guys, we're going to try it together. First impressions together. And then I got myself some wings. So I'm going to put this in the oven, but not now. I'm going to put them around 6 o'clock because... I'm about to have a load today. Also, I'm supposed to go meet up with Buzzy for lunch. But I'm not sure for dinner, sorry. For for okay, we're gonna watch Scream. And then guys, I sleep so much. By the way, I'm about to I'm about to I'm about to John Wick. I've watched all the John Wicks, okay? And mind you, I only watched John Wick this no last year. I didn't know about John Wick until last year because of the song. Like Ni Babu no Ma Bengin. When I heard the song, I'm like, who the hell is John Wick? So I started I watched all of the movies last year in one sitting. Absolutely loved them. I was so shocked that a man could kill a whole fucking neighborhood because they killed his dog, you know? And then this one, the last one. I just felt like it was dragging it was taking for i literally was sleeping in the cinema my boyfriend had to wake me up three times he was like if i wake up for the fourth time i'm literally going to scream <laughs> i was passing <laughs> no way i hated it i hated the last one like i just i don't i was just i was just, uh, i hated the last one i'm sorry if you're gonna watch john wick don't even waste your time the other ones were nice this one no but anyway um and then after that i went to food lovers I got myself some cucumber. Mm -hmm. Natasha! I got Natasha. <laughs> and then a croissant or croissant, however you want to call it. Of course, some bananas for my smoothies. And then some tomatoes. And then I tell her in my cornflakes. I bought the smallest pack because, as you guys know, if you stay alone, you don't need a big pack. Oh, sorry, from Woolies, I got the double cream. Um, strained wild honey blossom yogurt. If you know, you know. OG on my channel. Absolutely love this girl. Incredible. Of course, I went and got myself some cheese curls. And then I went and got some knickknacks. I'm gonna open them. You guys already know. Like, I feel like you guys know my grocery already. Gun to my head. You guys know my group. Like, a gun to your head. Sorry. The task. What I call these groceries, you guys know Mary. Okay. And then I got myself some egg glucose. Guys, I suck. Like I I suck. Okay? I suck. I I, I three. I'm almost certain they've expired. The last vlog, three weeks ago, I bought these and I told myself I'm gonna finish them. I'm gonna finish them. These have expired on 1903, 2023. 1903, 2023. Today is January we in April, thanks, but guys, I don't finish, I don't finish food, like, I really don't finish food, so I have to throw these, I feel like on every single fucking vlog, I'm throwing out eggs, and I swear I'm gonna finish these, I'm gonna, when do these expire? 05, 08, sorry, 08, <clears throat> January, February, March, April, May, 08, 05, 2023, see? This is why I will never buy 60 eggs, game now. I'll never buy 18, or if they have 12 or i'm almost as if i could buy two eggs i would like 
literally two eggs I would because I don't finish them and I have a whole so I buy six eggs because literally this is the waste so I'm gonna throw these ones and then I swear to god I'm gonna eat I swear I'm gonna eat this the whole week I'm gonna finish them I'm gonna eat two every day I'm gonna finish them so let's throw these ones out and then after that what else yeah I got this it's the chopped it's the diced onion sorry from food lovers market they make life 10 times easier not two people finishing the, the, the not two people finishing the built at food lovers i knew it and that's exactly why i'm going to get a man because then 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 you can see same thing when you don't come and see it because why need a single thing guys really you guys actually do hate me my name is on the cunning chain because why would you finish my built like i went there and i was just like why don't put it at it so, and he really it's just that i didn't get a he's he was like hey sis i mean i'm asked what happened Ever since you started buying this built on HHA pair, and I'm just like, I put the I know. And they are about mines. And they are my darlings. They will they will make sure. <laughs> so Nick Tati built on I said. And then I tell her my cotta penny. Um I wanna I wanna make bread. Me to cotta penny to archa. I don't know my chips, it's not carapawa. Why got it big? In the US same time, but anyway. And then once in a while I get myself a little lunch, but I'm not I don't have a sweet tooth, but yeah. And then I got myself some cheese. Because like I said, I want to I'm gonna eat breakfast, I swear to god. So I'm gonna make cheese, I'm gonna make um that's why I got one because I knew if I if I buy a lot, it don't feel like I got one croissant and then tomorrow morning I'm gonna make a cute sandwich, you know, and be me and be cute for once. You know? So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. And then we went to this game. I got myself some future life. I am obsessed with putting future life in my smoothies. It just makes them thick. It's so filling. Like instead of collagen, I put future life. Obviously, I, I use collagen because I use the hydro watch my collagen from this game. Let me show you guys before you say I didn't show you. This is the collagen that I use. Um hydro pure hydrolyzed collagen from this game. This is lifestyle food. This is the one that I use. Absolutely love her. So I add my what's this? I add my future life. It's so filling. Like I absolutely I get full so quickly and I'm full for because I, I make my smoothies run about 10. I'll be full until like one o'clock. So I absolutely love future life and it's so nice also. I think that's what I love about it. And then I got myself some mousse, some olive oil wrap set mousse. This is for my curls. I saw it on TikTok. This other lady was using it for her curls. Absolutely love how they came out. It's not exactly the one that she used. But almost on the same line. And then I wanted to show you guys something. It's just that um, ish, my hair is just a mess. I've been using this oil for two months on my hair. Right? I got mine from Pet though. I remember I, saw, I bought it when I was in Dallas Brits when I went home for something. I got mine from Pet. But I also when I, when I saw it at um, this game, I said I'm not going to need it. I've been using it for two months on my hair. My hair has grown and it is. My hair is not thick by the way guys. Um pregnancy fucked up my hair like nine years ago i was pregnant with my son my hair has never gone back to normal i just hope <laughs> never mind but whoa nine years ago when i was pregnant with my son i lost my hair so my hair hasn't been the same anymore but ever since i've been using this oil you can get it from pep i'm almost certain it's like 30 rand I absolutely love it. It just has given my skin some, you know. So I'm hoping, anyway. But yeah, use this. <laughs> just use it. Anyway, um, and then I got myself the LA Girl Pro Face High Definition Matte Pressed Powder in the shade. What shade is this? In nude beige, right? Because I'm gonna make a whole video of drugstore um, makeup that you can buy, that you can get, or whatever, whatever you guys have been asking for me, because you guys love the get ready with me. So yeah, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna do it. So it's the LA Girl one, and then I. Oh, so I took the. I hope I. Don't, hey, this looks like mine. I hope. Hey, we'll see. But I'm gonna mix it. This is the LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Fun. Before, before we were makeup gurus, we used to use LA Girl. So yeah, I bought that. And then I just got, I have pure soap in there, but I don't know why. 
I literally have pure soap, guys. I have bundles of pure soap because you know I always alternate between pure soap. But I'm going to see why I went to go buy just one. I don't know why. But yeah, I want to I wanna go back to pure soap and use it on my face. I feel like my, my eyes, maybe it's the soap that I'm using because I told um, my doctor, you guys know my doctor, who pits, and then she was like, um, Patty Grace. And then she was like, no, you're already on pregnancy, so I don't know what's happening. Wash your brushes, whatever. I've washed my brushes, I've done everything. I'm just like... I'm still here. So yeah, I went to Pure Soap. I don't know why. And then I am. Um, I bought my cranberry. Egg. Guys, when I saw 30s, I said, "Gonna, I'm 20. I'm turning 29." And I'm just like, but for some reason, if you watch Genie, is it Jean Frankie, Genie and Genie and Frankie on Netflix? Absolutely love those women. Like especially Jean. Is it G Jane? Genie, Gina and Frankie. Something like that. The other one with the short hair, with the short hair, with the short hair. Oh my, her, oh my girl, but risky with the short hair. Want the short? I absolutely love her. I feel like she, she makes looking old so. It, I just love her. Like she makes me want to look forward to be to getting older. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, and I feel like obviously we're not getting younger, but I just feel like I'm looking forward to be 30. I don't know why, but obviously I, I, I kind of sort of know why, but I can't wait to be 30 and you guys are gonna see obviously but like i'm just looking forward to getting older and growing and just being you know just cooler man you know and i don't know i just have this new ever since i've been watching genie and whatever frankie i just have this new lease on life that it's actually have it's actually amazing and it actually gets better as you grow older do you get what i'm saying so if you guys know i once bought the urinary urinary tract Yuri clear rather because one thing about me I don't know what happens I get a lot of um, and it's normal with every female if you think that it is isn't normal then entirely up to you but I get a lot of you to ask because I don't like using um there's a lot of things that, contrib that contribute to you to eye so I can't pinpoint what it is especially so just in order for me to be okay I just use this so that it's you know everything is just in balance you get what I'm saying so yeah I use these. You guys can get them at this game. I think they're 100 and something. 190 if I'm not mistaken. But yeah. And then I got myself some tissues, which you guys don't need to see. So I'm just going to pack this quickly. And then after that, I am going to start curling the hair. Like I said, I told you guys that I'm going to see Paul on Tuesday for lunchy lunch. So my electricity is leaving now at 4. It's going to come back at 6. Um, yeah, I'm going to curl the hair. And then we're going to do a little bit of skincare. Because Petty said I'm a... Not Petty, sorry. I was googling then somebody said if you steam your face maybe the bacteria that is stuck on your face is gonna leave so which I'm gonna try doing that so yeah I'll see you guys when I'm done packing up here set up to show you guys how I roll the hair because I've been saying I want to show and then yeah we'll call it a day yeah <laughs> guys here's the show I was telling you about I just didn't know the name Grace and Frankie absolutely love them but um Oh, I love the show so much. I'm on season one, episode 10. But I'm just going to pause it and then I'll play it when I'm busy doing the hair. So I want to show you guys what you need for the hair. Wait, just, it's loading. Why is it taking forever? Okay, anyway. Okay. So I want to show you everything that you are going to need. I should stop the lights. I know you guys remember these. These are from the previous vlog. I got them from Shein, right? So the ones I used were these ones. If you want to get the exact same curl like mine, you'd have to use these ones. So I already used these ones. Obviously, you guys saw when I was undoing the hair. So I used these curls. I don't want to lie to you. There's no name or size. They just... Hey, there's no name or size guys they just said magic curler twist flexi rods foam curler there's oh wait 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 there's a size wait 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 just just wait there's the paper inside okay six inch sizes these are the sizes Why would they say six inch sizes? Maybe if they had a picture, like you know, because there's 42 inside. But I'm assuming this is the medium ones. Okay, if you buy them, you're gonna use the pink, the orange, and the yellow ones. Okay, 
And then these ones I got from a company that I was doing um, a hair review for. I wanted to see if they're the same size, which they definitely are. They definitely, just that these ones are longer. So what you're going to do is in order for you to have, you guys remember when I was un undoing the ones at the back, because I did them with the bigger size, they were, they were long and I didn't get the full effect of having them because I wanted them puffy a bit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use these ones at the back and then after that continue with these ones on top, right? So yeah, you're going to use those and then you're going to need a mannequin head and obviously your wig. So like I said, since Tuesday I'm going up looking poor, I'm going to be wearing this wig. I haven't worn this wig. The last time I wore this wig was at Black Door and then I washed it. Like the last time I wore this hair was at Black Door. I remember very well. Me and Marianne Gato went out and I wore this wig at Black Door. So I washed it and this is it. This is my 99J wig. You guys know I don't like wearing colored hair, but I said I'm gonna wear it with this girl. So yeah, let's get started and not waste any time. Um I don't know if I want a side part or a middle part, but we'll see. We'll see. So what you're gonna do is section the hair obviously. Um I like to go from down here. That's how you start, right? Um I forgot to tell you inside my hair's just water and conditioner. So you can just put water in any conditioner. I prefer Tresemme, honestly. So just comb this out. Make sure that everything is just straight. And then, honestly, if you want to get better results, I prefer you taking it in smaller chunks than like taking, like you see now, it's that this, you just take two like this. I prefer you have maybe four or three, right? So that you can get the most out of your curl. You can get like, you know, a more rounded curl. So you just comb it out. Take your water and conditioner, spray it. Don't make it too damp, but like entirely up to you. Each to their own. I prefer mine to be a little, not too damp, but yeah. And then you comb it through, right? And then after that you take your curler so you can start from the bottom like roll it like this and then make your way up right like so it's especially if you are a beginner this could be easier for you let me just do this this would be so much easier for you if you are beginning you don't know how to do this properly this is 10 times easier do you see that and then you just roll it like that Simple. I know I'm saying simple, <laughs> but honestly, I first also struggled when I was doing it for the first time. But once you get used to it, trust me, baby. And then comb it through. Take another one. Roll from the end, make your way up. So now I'm going to show you another section where you can roll it differently than you did the first one. If you find it difficult to hold it at the end, I'm going to show you another way how to roll it, but you're going to get the same outcome, right? Okay, so I've just sectioned my hair, right? Let me put you guys a bit up. I've just sectioned my hair, and I'm going to show you guys the other way to curl your hair if, like, that other method was a bit hard. Let me just turn this around. So what you do is, of course, water. And then, let me just put this on the side so it doesn't disturb us. Just comb that. 
As in, okay, comb that, and then you start. Can you guys see? You start from the top and then you go round. Please don't twist the hair as you go around, the hair has to remain straight because if you twist it, it's gonna come out as one curls. So, you don't want to twist the hair, the hair must be straight. Just like that. And then when you're done, you put that up. And then you close that. Literally. Another section. Water. Don't twist it, please, because you're gonna come up with wand curls and you do not want wand curls. And mind you, these are not gonna be perfect as you're starting, but I'm almost certain once you get used to it, you're gonna perfect your craft. But honestly, for me, I prefer starting from the bottom and making your way up it's easier that way for me personally so we all have personal preference i've showed you two ways to style your wig um, but me honestly i prefer the method of starting from the bottom like this and then making my way up honestly this this one is more easier for me and it's really quicker. So I'm gonna finish this and then I'm gonna show you guys how to do the ones on top. I don't know if you guys can see, but I'm finally on top. <laughs> Excuse the pan, but I'm finally on top, right? So this is the top part. What you're gonna do is, you're gonna take a smaller and a six, how, how are you guys gonna see this? Wait, let me try to do this. Can you guys see? So this is the top part, right? Put you guys down. I'm sorry if you, ugh, can you guys see? But anyway, this is the top part, right? When you get to the top, you want to curl the hair so that it come it it oh my god how do i explain this when you curl the hair you must curl it towards you is that how they say it? yeah towards you something like that so water All right and then comb it but this one depends on how you want your hair to fall because I like my hair falling in a way that I can maneuver the curl something like that. So, take this. I hope you guys can see. You go down like that. And then you just roll. Right? Just roll. Don't, don't, uh, must this. Don't make the hair tight because it's going to come out as a wand curl. And if there's one thing that you don't want is a wand curl. So keep the hair straight and just roll it towards you. And then when you're done, you're going to lock it. Just like that. Just like that. Okay, kids? Just like that. Then you're going to continue 
the other side. I don't know. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is the end product of how you want your curls to look like. I'm gonna go redo these two because I feel like they are not holding. Sorry, these two are not holding. But this is what they look like. I opened the middle part because I wanted that. Also, this wig is a five by five, so that's why I opted for a middle part. But yeah, that's how my curls look like. I'm gonna redo those two quickly and then talk to you guys. Like But anyway, I feel like I forgot to tell you guys all about Foshini. So I went to Foshini, you guys saw me go to Foshini. I think the clothes are very cute, but there's a select pieces that obviously I would take. Honestly, I I don't know what the hype is about because oh my god, everything is the prices are very wild. I'm sorry. The prices are very wild. I saw a shoe, and that shoe you can actually get that shoe anyway. I'm talking with the price. It's those smaller and a quartz heel shoe. It's yeah, those those cute one man, those ones, yeah, you know what I'm talking about. And that shoe was 900 I said So tonight will be the night that I will fall for you. Why is the shoe 900 Especially at Foshin. I don't know man. I don't know, but I was just like I don't know, maybe when I'm dry wasn't for the sheen. Because you guys know me, I buy my clothes from machine. And that was the first time I think in over a year, I went inside a store and I was like, I'm looking for something. Because I wanted to go to Cotton On. I saw, I don't know if you guys saw the jeans on Michali and um, what's her name? And Boyd's. They were absolutely gorgeous. Figure hugging, you know, there's no gapping, there's nothing like that. So I was like, I want to go try them. So I'm actually like, I was in Cotton On. Um, what, what, at this mall. It's the other side. I said, there's no idea that. Because already I parked at Woolies and I had to walk to this game. If you know the distance, you know. So I was just like, there's actually no. But yeah, so I'm going to make a quick meal. Um, I'm going to show you guys what I'm going to do. I don't know. Somebody asked me, why do I give my six gun spice in the fridge? Guys, I don't know. I saw from Guy Fieri. Is it Guy Fieri or something like that? Guy Fieri, he said that some of the spices you should put in the fridge. I don't know. Maybe it makes it more nice or something like that. But yeah, if you know Guy Fieri, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So yeah, so I'm going to make my my wings and then I'm going to just have um, I already put one cup of rice in here because I know that I'm not I don't like good little guys, especially if I'm not gonna be drunk. You get what I'm saying? If I'm gonna make food, I want it to finish. So I feel like I'm gonna eat this today and I'm gonna try eat it tomorrow again. But I don't like it like I said, especially if I'm not drunk. Because I know if I'm drunk the next morning, I'm going to eat anything that's in the fridge because I don't have time to order. But anyway, um, yeah. I'm just going to start cooking now. I'm not going to cook well, but I'm just going to put everything in the pan and then put it in the... What's this thing? Put my meat in the oven and then my rice is going to heat up. But I'm not doing anything extra. Bank on it. You can put a hundred gram on it. Anything I said, I stamp on it. In a private plane, I lamp on it. Let the order to call me bank on it. Cause I walk around with the bank on it. Show them Gangnam style, put the gang on him. Twist my fingers up on a bang on him. Let the old, let the old, yeah. Tobalo, go macho, yeah. Tobalo, my go macho, yeah. Nobody know tomorrow. Choro, ka choro. And if 
beautiful boy feel my joy Make him look red like a tomato If him not dead then he call my toes No go from And if a boy feel my joy, make him look red like a tomato. If him not dead, then he call my toes. No, go from The food is almost ready. Just the chicken that's left, so I'm gonna start plating up. I just wanted to show you guys. This is like the soup type of situation that I like. See, when the um, what's this? The onions. I don't know if you're an OG follower here, you know that I love when my veggies are chewy, especially my onions. Absolutely love when I can chew my onions. I don't like like overly cooked onions and stuff like that. So my rice is ready. I'm gonna take out my meat now, plate up and eat. I'm starving. Um, I'm gonna have a glass of wine. I haven't had wine in a damn minute, okay? I haven't had wine in a damn freaking minute. I'm gonna have, I don't even know how to pronounce it, but Fifi got it for me. It tastes amazing. I don't know how to pronounce this long ass word. I don't know where she got it from. So, let me just rinse this, I'm coming. So I'm gonna have some wine and watch Ease or Easel. I can't believe my parents never used to let us watch Ease or Easel, guys. Like, how insane is that? You know, the white wine that I absolutely love, also Fifi, um, is the one that told me that wine. It's creation wine. We first had that wine at Big Mouth creation wine be it the red wine be it the white wine absolutely amazing but i love this as well i've saved ah oh, guys i haven't had wine in a minute it's champagne it's whatever it's whatever so i'm so happy to be having this and um i'm gonna dish up now then we are going to eat watch you so edit this vlog is supposed to be up today today's sunday but I just got back. I'm tired. I'll upload it tomorrow. You'll start your week on a very good, like, you know, very good, very good note. So I'm gonna take out all the salads that I that I bought. I don't think any of them have to be in the fridge. So I'm gonna put them in these containers that I got from these containers that I got from Pep Pep Home. So it's like four of them. It's one, two. This one already has soup in it. And then this is the fourth one. So I absolutely love these. I got them a long time ago though. So yeah. So I have to start with the with the rice. And then go ahead with the chicken. And then I'm gonna store everything else away. So you guys will see when I'm done plating though. I'll show you when I'm done so that I'm not gonna have a lot of rice because it's already eight o'clock, so I don't want that much stuff. But I'm gonna have a lot of salad and meat. Like I said, I don't have to put this in the microwave. I hate, absolutely hate um hot um spinach or tongue and it's just I hate it so much. So I just smash this a little bit before I eat it because I feel like they don't mash it enough. So I just mash this a bit. I might put this in the microwave. But in terms of the spinach, I don't like spinach that is hot. 
I'm about to have me a damn freaking feast. You know, I had to sprinkle, sprinkle some acha over there, but this is what I came up with. This is my plating. I did not cook all of this, but yeah, fast, easy, convenient. That is me. And with that being said, with that being said, I'm so sorry this vlog took forever, but you know, I had to handle business. I had to handle life. I had to handle, I had to handle a lot, but um, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you do enjoy the vlog. I promise you, I will never be. I'll never take two weeks to vlog ever again. But my vlog will definitely be um, spaced out because obviously it's a brand new week. Tomorrow I'm going to be vlogging. And then I'm going to vlog in Durban. And then, and then, and then, and then. <laughs> but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you guys. I love you guys so much. Also, thank you for 130,000 subscribers. I promise to give you world class content. I promise to give you amazing content. And I promise to stay consistent. Hopefully. I hope so. But anyway, thank you. Oh, my armpit is so bright. My armpits are getting brighter, guys. I think I'll tell you that's a secret. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. I will see you on my next vloggy vlog.